to our channel and today we're going to have Baby Unboxing! Yeah, so we have here B201 Zest Aquiles Customized Set Yay! Yeah, so this features Zest Aquiles Illegal Quattro Dash 4 Yeah, so we also have two other layers here We have Chain Phoenix and Hollow Ragnarok Yay. Yeah, so we have a recolor version of Chain and a recolor version of Hollow from the Super King series Super King. Yes, it also comes with Fortress disc and an upgrade for the never driver. So we have metal never here. Yeah, no driver. <laughs> yeah. So um, this all uh, this set also comes with the new gear for the upgrade of divine. Yes, a new so gear. We have a gear. So a gear is um like the F gear in yeah. the dynamite or DB series. So this is an upgrade for the layer of divine. So, are you ready? Yeah! Let's go! first of this Zesta Kiles customized set. Okay, so first we have here a black recolor of the chain layer as well as a recolor of the Phoenix DB core. Yeah. So as you can see we have a black recolor of the chain with the purple stickers. So nice. Ooh. Yeah, we also have this clear accent here, the bottom part of the layer which also gives it a nice uh, touch in this color scheme. Simple but elegant. We also have here a silver Phoenix DB core. Phoenix core is Yes. It's like a dark side layer. Yeah. <laughs> nice. And then next we have here a Super King recolor. So we have here a Halo recolor. So we have here yellow gold recolor as well as a Ragnarok core. Nice. The Halo layer was initially released in Halo Dead Sighter and then in Halo Valkyrie. Then we have here the fortress disc. Yay, fortress. So another fortress disc here. And a new driver. So an upgraded version of the Never driver. So we have here a new driver, the upgraded version of the Never. So we have Metal Never. Cool. Then we have here the new upgrade gear for Yay. the line. So we have a gear. So let's just focus with the eager for a while. So let's get the divine layer. Okay, so we have here the divine layer. So unlike the um, F gear, so we have F gear here. So the F gear works both for divine and dynamite and dangerous. But for this A gear, it can only work with the divine layer. So for the default mode of this A gear in the Divine layer, you have to check the star markings on the pegs of this A gear. So as you can see, there are two star markings here. Then when you flip the Divine layer, you will also see a star marking. So let's see, so there. So here is the star marking. There. Okay, so what you need to do when you will put it, it should be in the middle of those two star in the A gear. Then it will give you the default three blade mode of divine. So it's like that. So it's three blade because only the three main blades of um, divine is visible. So the A gear just lifts it up. So it's like that. So that's what, what it does in the default three blade mode. Then if you turn it around like 180 degree rotation so you can see it will form the six blade mode. So the three big blades of A gear, A gear will now be visible together with the three main blades of the divine layer. So this will give you the six blade mode. Nice. So let's try to build it with the other parts of the layer. So here is the Divine Belial with the A gear. So it's in the three blade mode. So as you can see, the layer is now thick together with the D gear as well. That's a thick layer. Yay. Nice. Okay, so we also have the V gear there. 
to move. Okay, so let's look at it in the six blade mode. So here it is Divine Belial with a gear in six blade mode. So you can see there. Nice. The three big blades of the A gear is now visible in the layer. Cool. So this Divine Belial now has three gears. So we're just waiting for one more to make it the perfect gear version. Yeah. Okay. So there you have it. A gear in Divine Belial. Okay, so here is our main Beyblade that is featured in this customized set. So we have just Achilles Illegal Water Dash 4. Yeah. So these Beyblades have six parts. Yeah. Okay, so, um, so let's see. First, the core. So we have the classic look of the Achilles core here. Nice. So it's a classic red, blue, and gold, yellow yeah. color combination. Just so nice. Cool. Then we have the layer so the main layer somehow similar also with the previous Achilles layers yeah. then we have the attachment the blade attachment so um, what's nice about this new attachment is that it has design as well so before yeah. it's just a one colorway design for the infinite blade and now we have this cool accent so we have gold silver and red accents yeah. It's so cool. Yeah, which, which really improves the overall look of the Achilles layer. Nice. Nice job by Takara, Tommy, for this one. Okay, so we also have here the new disc. So we have Illegal Disc. Yeah. What a unique and somehow strange name for this yeah. disc. It's illegal. So you can see, it looks like an over disc, right? Yeah, it looks like over. But it has just more holes in it. Whereas the uh, over this is more of a solid yeah. version of this one. Then we have the armor. So we have a new armor as well for. So this armor is balanced on both sides in terms of weight. There. We have here the upgraded version of the Quattro driver. So we have Quattro dash driver there. So it still have those four modes. So first we have here the balance, balance mode. So for you to change modes, you need to pull the two lever on the side. Up, and then it will release the tip for you to change yeah. so next is defense defense the double tip and then next attack. attack the flat rubber tip and then the last one is stamina stamina the pointy tip metal tip okay cool so for you to put in that mode you need to press it down once you select the mode you wanted cool yeah. so let's try to build the layer so Achilles has three modes, balance, attack, and defense. So balance is the one that has no sword attachment. So it's like this. Okay, so that's balance mode. Cool. So if you want to put it in attack, you need to attach the sword. On the top. Yes. Now, for defense mode, you need to put the sword attachment at the bottom. Yeah. Okay, so here it is in the defense mode. Yeah. Cool. So you can do this in high mode and low mode. So if you want to change the spin direction, you need to flip the layer. So there, so that will be in left spin, and then for the DP core, you just need to change mode by twisting the middle part of the core, then put it in the mode that you want it in. Okay. So here it is, Zest Achilles, left spin, balance mode. Yeah. Okay, so let's see it in attack mode. There is just Achilles, let's spin in attack mode. Yeah. Okay, so let's see it in defense. Now, here is just Achilles in left spin defense mode. Cool, so you, again, you can do this in high mode as well. 
So let's do a recap of all the layer modes for Zazakidis. Okay, so here you have it, the Zazakidis customized set. Yeah. Uh, so many parts, so many modes, right? So many modes. Yeah, that's so tiring. All the mode changing for Zes Achilles. How many modes? 48! <laughs> yes! So next video, we will test it in battles with the other BB Blades. Yay, hey, battle! Yeah. So thank you for watching this video. Uh, please keep supporting our channel. And please don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye! Bye.